In this video, I'll be going over the open mics of the Texas Hill Country area. This includes San Marcos and New Braunfels. So if you're interested in understanding the music scene of the Texas Hill Country, if you want to see what some bars and restaurants and saloons look like, or if you're just curious about seeing what the Hill Country looks like, then check out this video. Now I'll put three sources below. There's a Facebook page that people post these open mics to. There's a New Braunfels live music events page that's really helpful. And there's a website for San Marcos where you can find live music. Those are all some important resources. But let's kick this off with number one. First up is Riley's Tavern. This is where Kayla Jane hosts a picker circle. And this happens on Sunday. So a good way to spend a Sunday afternoon. A lot of talented folks there. A nice little circle that you could have there in the back of the tavern. Kayla Jane is a great host, very nice person. So a good way to spend a Sunday. Next up, we're looking at Monday open mic at Middleton Brewing in San Marcos. This is hosted by Tom Taylor. And this is a great open mic. They they have a listening room there so people are very attentive a great audience for you and there's a lot of really talented folks there so they're really worth listening to too I like beer. Beer. next up we turn to tuesday nights where the poor house has an open mic this is in new braunfels and the poor house is a pretty special place i think it's one of the best places to catch music especially right there on that uh, square of new braunfels I had a good time at the open mic. This was during the colder time of year, so they had the fires going and folks were gathering around the fires, so it was kind of easy to talk to people. And the host changed for this one. This one was hosted by JJ from the JJ Garrett Band. Uh, they have some others who host there too. But I definitely recommend The Poor House, especially coming back on one of those uh, really fun nights where you can drink a lot of beers and uh, catch one of the bands playing. Also on Tuesday is Sean Patricks. This is at The Square in San Marcos, hosted by Kalani. She's a great open mic host, uh, very supportive, and uh, you know makes you feel comfortable and good while you're playing up there. I met some folks, pretty uh, talented and interesting folks, and they're a bit more open about what they bring in. So they had some poets up there, there was a comedian. Which I kind of liked, uh, kind of changes the energy uh, when you're alternating between these different creative outlets. Also on Tuesday is Martindale River Cafe. This one's hosted by Sterling Finley. It's in Martindale. They got a pretty small little strip right there in that town of Martindale, so it kind of feels like you're escaping. Get that fresh air out there. Pretty intimate uh, little area, and I recognized some folks from some other open mics there. So I was entertained to uh, talk to them again and hear them play the songs again. There is a lot of talent here in the Hill Country area that you can catch. Now we turn to Wednesday, a pretty famous uh, place, Cheatham Street Warehouse. This is the place where George Strait first formed his band and had a weekly gig. Stevie Ray Vaughan did the same. It's in San Marcos, and it's the Kent Finley's Songwriters Circle. This is hosted by Missoula Slim. Kent Finlay did a lot to set this up and make this happen. He was known to be there and to have a certain spot where he would sit and listen to everybody play. And he did it for a long time. So Missoula Slim is carrying that torch and keeping it alive. It is a real songwriter focus, so only original songs. You play a couple each. It's a listening room, so you're going to listen to the folks. And then at the very end, they, they play the Hill Country song written by Kent Finlay himself. Also on Wednesday is Gray Horse Saloon in San Marcos, hosted by Pat Kelly. When I went there, I always like to go to a saloon, kind of feel interested to check out an open mic there, a little bit of an exciting, uh, maybe rowdy crowd. So I enjoyed that one and uh, felt good while I was up there. I enjoyed the sound and uh, met some folks. Also on Wednesday is the Phoenix Saloon right there in the town square of New Braunfels. Hosted by Andy Holloman, and she's a great host, very kind, very big uh, person in the New Braunfels music community. So I met quite a few folks there, uh, energetic and talkative uh, crowd that was uh, pretty excited to talk to each other and listen to each other. 
Next up is the Lone Star Lounge in New Braunfels. This is a few blocks away from the Phoenix Saloon on that same night, so some folks were just walking over. I was told about this by Sasquatch Slim. You could see him featured in the video. I gotta come back next time and actually play at this one because I just uh, popped over, but it looks pretty cool. Then we got the Shade Tree Saloon and Grill. This is a pretty epic uh, songwriter round. So again, focus on songwriters, original songs only. It is a round, so you alternate between the three folks up there hosted by david lee who's a well-established songwriter he's done some great things work with some people you've heard of so you get to go up there sit in the chair and then david lee plays the uh, famous hit that he wrote for cody johnson and then you get to go up there a little intimidating Thursday night, we got the Redbird Listening Room. This is an amazing place. Can't wait to go back there. Can't wait to check out some uh, and listen to some uh, shows here. It's in New Braunfels, hosted by Dallas Burrow, and he's trying to create an environment like the Bluebird in Nashville or uh, Cheatham Street Warehouse in San Marcos. And it is a really intimate venue. You just play a couple songs. Very attentive, uh, listening crowd. So it's a really exciting place to play. They call it the hill country. I call it home. What will they call it? When it's leveled in the also on Thursday, Savage's Hill Country Bar, another epic place. It's in Wimberley, hosted by Michael James, Larry McDonald, and the band. These guys got a lot of history in the Texas music and a fantastic uh, backing band, fantastic band to play along with if they'll uh, play along with you. So just more great talent just hanging out there in the Texas Hill Country. Thursday also is Vine in the Village in Bulverde, hosted by Nick Paulison. There was a nice group of uh, people who consistently go there for the open mic to play. They were pretty nice. We all sat there at the table. It was St. Patrick's Day, so people were extra happy and extra into playing drinking songs. And also on Thursday is Stellar Coffee Company. This is in the San Marcos Square. I always like open mics at coffee places because, uh, I don't know, it's a more relaxed, different vibe. You don't have to drink. You could just get all caffeinated. And typically it's more of a listening uh, audience, which was pretty good, pretty good listening audience here. Sean Ryan was a host, and the vi video features Zach Blue. Uh, and I've seen him play uh, with the Gooeys here at Stellar Coffee Company quite a bit. So that's your rundown of the open mics in the Texas Hill Country. There was 14 of them in this video. I hope that you got a sense for what the Texas Hill Country has to offer what the music scene looks like. If you're looking for open mics, I think you could get a good uh, idea where you might want to go from this. And I uh, appreciate you checking out this video. I post regularly about my music and my musical experiences. So hit that subscribe and the bell button to stay tuned on my posts on my channel. Let me know in the comments of anything you missed or any comments that you have, anything I should check out in the area. And I appreciate your support. So thanks for checking out this video.